Hey guys, and what is up? In this video, we are doing the Shiver Teeth vs. the Gobstucker. Now guys, this is How to Train the Dragon. This is a tournament. Whoever wins this battle will move on to the next round. This is a tournament. So guys, who would win if they had a 1v1? Go check out the other videos. This is based off of one advantages and disadvantages. Disadvantages. Two, agility and speed. And three, overall power now first the gobstucker isn't very a strong isn't a very strong dragon now it is in the mystery class and the only thing it can do is acid blast and flammable gas from its rear end so this isn't the best thing Unlike most dragons, which emit fire from their mouths and scales, monstrous nightmare or singe tails, for example, the gobstucker shoots flammable gases from its rear end. This fire does not simply serve the purpose of other dragons' fire. It helps the dragon fly straighter, faster, and take off. This ability makes it hard to sneak up on the gobstucker as anyone who approaches from behind will be potential be a potential victim of a gobsucker. According to Gobber, this dragon's ability to fly is entirely dependent on the release of the explosives gases. As such, a Viking would never approach this dragon from behind. Its weaknesses is gobsuckers cannot shoot any fire at someone else that unless no, sorry, let me start that over. Gobstuckers cannot shoot anywhere fire at someone unless they are behind them. Other than that, the only attack they have is strength. Also, it can't fly if it is out of shots. And the down dragon is a dead dragon. So for those reasons, it deserves a 1 out of 5. Because you can't really get behind a dragon. No, like, you can't really get in front of a dragon when it can shoot lava, you know? So, the Shiver Tooth is sort of like a Timberjack. At the same time, it's really not. Now, the Shiver Tooth is a very different dragon. It has... Its abilities is slicing. Its jet, its egg is one of the coolest out of all of them, I think. Its shot limit is only four, though. The Shiver Tooth is said to have the sharpest claws of any dragon. They are described as being able to slice Vikings and leave them in stitches. This is a useful attack or defense strategy. They are also said to have sharp scales. Very sharp spines lining down on their back, and a sharp-edged arrowhead-shaped tail end. Similar to the Be Bewilderbeast, Wooly ho Howl, Snow Wraith, and Wind Nasher, the Shiver Tooth shoots ice at its opponents. Now, that was... It for the Shiver Tooth advantages and dis disadvantages. Now, for those reasons, it deserves a 5 out of 5, which wins the first round. Now, by the way, guys, if you are wondering, this is the Gobsucker's egg. So, guys, the Gobsucker for speed and agility. The gobsucker is known. It there's nothing really to say about it, unless, except it isn't the fastest dragon because it is so big and it isn't that. Let's just so far look look at it real quick. It has some big dragon and small wings, which some spikes on it. It kind of looks like that one. Dinosaur, sort of. So let's go back to the egg part. So, guys, 
Yeah, there's nothing really to slay. It isn't that big. It isn't, sorry, it isn't that fast. And it isn't really that, doesn't have that much agility or stamina. So, for those reasons, it does deserve a 4 out of 5, though. Because, I mean, it, oh, I forgot to look at the things. It can actually, it is fast, actually. Because it, it uses the blast, the flammable gas to make it faster and steer straight. But once it goes out of that gas, then that's it. It can't fly, and it can't really do much. Although, when it does have that, it is has lots of speed fortified for that so guys by the way this is the shiver tooth's egg now this is just looks so good this is probably my favorite egg out of every single dragon maybe um it do it looks like an ice it looks just so good now guys this is actually the fastest it is the fastest shark class dragon with a speed similar to a snow wraith. The Shiver Tooth, for its uh, intelligence, is described as cunning and having quick, sharp wits. It is said to use its smarts against both friend and pranks and foe in combat. So, this is the fastest shark class dragon, if you did not know that. So though, for those reasons, it deserves a 5 out of 5. So that is it. The Shiver Tooth already wins in winning both two of the fights. Both of the speed and agility. And we take stamina into account as well. And the advantages and disadvantages. So of course the overall power goes to Shiver Tooth if he wins both battles. But guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. By the way, guys, look what's on the bracket now. So guys, as you can see, as you can see, the Shiver Tooth is now on the the top next round. Now, guys, this isn't the full bracket. I do have like a full printed out bracket from both sides of. Like you can see, it only goes to the middle, which is right here at the cursor. And it, there's nothing coming from the other side, the right side of the book, of the, like, bracket thing. I do have the actual bracket, which is great. Um, I'll show that, show that in another video. But for now, thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and comment saying what you think will win. Knife Fury or Change Wing. And as you guys can see now, um, the monstrous nightmare versus the catastrophic quaking. Um... So guys, I'm super hyped. Knife Fury vs. Changewing, that will be an epic battle. Who will face the Shiver Tooth? The Knife Fury or the Changewing? Then we got the Egg Rider vs. the Deadly Nana. But real quick, real quick, let's just focus on the Knife Fury vs. the Changewing. Anyway guys, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya.